Hey everybody, what is going on? Um, I just wanted to give you guys a little update on the update that came out uh, for Diablo 3 Reapers of Souls for console, Xbox One, and PS4. Now, you're going to notice that uh, when you first load up the game, you're going to see the Darkening of Tristram event. Uh, you're going to go ahead and go there. Okay, you're going to come all the way down to the old ruins and you're going to see a portal. Okay. It's going to lead you to Tristram, but it's going to be the older version of Tristram. And now you're going to want to go all the way until you see Adria's house where it would be in the new game. Uh, you'll, when you first start out, you'll see a cauldron here and it'll be waiting for you to put something in it. Now, what you're going to want to do, you can click on these if you would like. doesn't really matter. Um, however... Once you realize that you can't do that, you're going to want to come all the way up here. And this is going to lead you to the old cathedral, church, whatever you want to call it. Basically, you're going to go through all of those levels. However, before you go through all 16 levels, I recommend stopping at level 9 to go and get the mushroom. I, I forget what the actual name of the mushroom is. It's like old mushroom or some weird mushroom you'll find it on the on the ground somewhere you gotta actually pick it yourself it'll say x to to get it or a if you're on xbox uh to pick it up and then once you do that you're gonna want to come back and you're gonna want to put it in this cauldron when you put it in this cauldron you're gonna get a vial of like this weird liquidy stuff and you're gonna want to come back all the way over here and you're gonna see all these guys that are laying on the ground you're gonna give it to all four of them. So you got one here, you got one here, I believe there's one down here. Yes, there's one down here, and there's one up here somewhere. Somewhere. That's not him, is it? No, that's not him. I think he's. Where is he? It's a fourth one. There's four people. One, two. And then there's three, oh, four. Okay, there's the, okay, so I missed one. Okay, so there's the four. They're in like that little square around the portal. And then once you click on the first one, you will get a an item. And then you got to go basically back and forth between characters. And it will give you the plan for Wart's leg. And then what you're going to want to do is go back to the town, the town area. I don't think I have it with me. I have to search for it. Alright, so this is the warts or warts leg. Uh, basically, it, it has you craft it. It is a two handed mace. If you scroll all the way down, you'll be able to make it. It is one million coin. So I would recommend um, having some coin to do this. So basically, once you create one, you're going to want to actually salvage it. So when you click on it, you're going to salvage it. And you're going to see on the right, it says items received, and it gives you this page. Okay. Now, the page is actually a code. If you look at the bottom, it says 213. So what you're going to want to do is go back to the old ruins. And you're going to want to go all the way back up to Adria's little hideout thingy. Oh, we gotta we gotta enter the old area again. We gotta actually enter the event. Excuse me. Okay, so now that we're in the old area, or the old Tristram, you wanna go. Blah, blah, blah. You're gonna wanna go to Adria's little hut thing here, and I already have mine done. But basically, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna look at the page, and I'm not sure if it's the same for everybody, so I do apologize. But the bottom three numbers, so two, one, three. Okay, so you're going to basically, the middle cow is 2, the cow on the left is 1, and then the cow on the right is 3. And what's going to happen is you're going to see on the side that over here by this little stump, it's going to light up. And what you're going to do is you're going to go in there, and you're going to basically complete it. Okay, so it's not extremely difficult or anything like that. You just got to go through it. It's not difficult. Relatively easy, actually. Um, 
but yeah guys so that is how to get the cow so once you go get the cow you actually once you're in the area there you are going to find a field and just past the field you will see a chest when you open the chest it'll give you the little outline or the little scroll on the ground for the cow and basically you're just going to check all the way down at the bottom of your little cosmetic list and it'll say royal calf and there is the royal calf now the next thing is how in the world do you get the butcher yes everybody wants this butcher he looks like a badass well in order to get him you need to unfortunately create a new character fresh level one character whatever gear you want on it is completely up to you so if you use modded gear you you can use modded gear whatever any gear just has to be a level one brand new character and then you load the game you go back to the old ruins and then once you go into the portal I wouldn't recommend killing anything because I'm not sure what it will do but as soon as you enter this portal to get into the old age you can kill stuff so you're not going to find anything to kill until you go all the way up to the labyrinth and then basically once you get in there you're going to want to go through all 16 levels and kill the Diablo 1 Diablo uh, which is at the very end and what you're going to do is you're going to notice once he dies he's going to drop a bunch of random stuff on the ground and he will he, he's going to be dead and then you're going to be like well there's nothing else to do well all you need to do is check your cosmetics once again and there will be the butcher uh, it's like a baby version of the butcher um, looks pretty cool if I don't say so myself on the side it says he may be little but he's fierce <laughs> I guess uh, I guess that fits the description but yeah guys so that is how you get the royal calf and the butcher as pets and that is how you also solve the little Adria's little hut over here um, like quest I guess you can say and how to activate the cows in a successful manner so anyways guys thank you for watching and until next time guys peace out